Well, hello there, fishing friends, and if you're new here, welcome. So on today's video, we will be concluding the Freshwater Rare series. We're going to be going after the Lake Sturgeon. This is on the US East DLC. And for Lake Sturgeon, we are going to be going to location S15. And as you can see here, he is on the bottom and he's only found in lakes. So let's go ahead and get started. We'll head out to S15 and I'll show you how to find this guy and how to catch him. Okay, so here we are on S15, the Niagara Falls location. And to find the Lake Sturgeon, it's going to be very similar to the Atlantic Sturgeon. Matter of fact, it's going to be identical to the Atlantic Sturgeon. We're going to use the fish finder and we're going to look for the only huge fish on this location. So let me go ahead and grab my pole here. As you can see, I do have a shiner on there. It's just like the other sturgeon. It is yellow on shiner and it is yellow on worm. So we'll jump over here. We'll look out here at our fish finder. Since it's a bottom fish, it's going to be this dim, huge fish right here. And like I said, it is the only huge fish. And luckily for us, the green fish are on top. We've got one green fish there, so that's not gonna bother us. So we're gonna go ahead and use the shiner. I'm gonna drop my line down to the bottom depth since it's only on the bottom. I'm gonna cast out out here. I do have rod B, so it's only gonna cast out to 250 feet, eh, which is about where he's at. So I'm probably gonna count about three, three in so that it's about there. Cast out and we'll catch this guy. Maybe. There we go. One, two, three. There were some bubbles right out there, so that was probably it. And we'll wait for the line to turn red. And because it is a yellow fish, it is a three to five count for the line to turn red. Or if you're not using line color. And we got a unique. <laughs> Let me go ahead and release this unique. If you didn't know when you release a unique, often you do not catch the same unique after you cast again. So, also to know that if you're going after uniques, you can't keep catching the same one over and over and over. If you release it, you don't always get that unique. Sometimes you do, but most of the time you don't. No, it's, all right, so it moved on me, it's straight ahead now. One, two, three, might be a little bit far to the right, we'll see. See if my line turns red. It did. So it was close enough. And hopefully we do not get that unique again. And we didn't. Like I said, once you release the unique, you don't always catch that same unique. Matter of fact, very rarely does it jump on your line again. Just something to note if you are fishing for the uniques, but you don't ever want to release it once you get that initial unique splash or unique jump. And this is kind of a pretty cool location. Never actually been to Niagara Falls in real life, but it'd be a neat place to go visit someday. Let me know down in the comments if you've ever been to Niagara Falls. And it does take a little bit to bring these fish in since they are huge. Using your C reel helps. Or your A reel, I'm sorry. <laughs> Using your A reel helps. Using your C reel will not help at all. It would make matters worse. <laughs> but using your A reel helps a lot. But we almost got it in here. And like I said in the previous video, I'm pretty sure that the Atlantic sturgeon and the lake sturgeon are the only two huge freshwater fish, rare freshwater fish that have been introduced to the game. So it's kind of neat. And there we go. There's our lake sturgeon. Oh, I got a giant fish reward. And that happened to be my personal best out of seven that I've caught. So pretty neat. All right, well, there you go. That's how you catch the uh, lake sturgeon, or how you find it and catch the lake sturgeon. 
So hopefully this video was helpful for you. And if it was, make sure you give me a thumbs up on it. And if you haven't done so already, hit that subscribe button so you can see more videos like this in the future. I will be doing more rares. We'll be heading over to the ocean next and doing some rare fish. And then I'll be going into the epics and the unique fish after that. So you'll want to come back for those videos. That's why you want to hit that subscribe button. So thanks for watching. You have a great day. Bye-bye.